just like that. Is the latest innovation that's drawing worldwide attention. Pretty quick and easy. <laughs> I don't know what it was. I didn't really feel anything, to be honest. Central Wisconsin company offering its employees a microchip plant. How the party to kick off the new program. Around 50 employees at Three Square Market gathered to get the microchip. It's about the size of a grain of rice and gets implanted into the hand using a syringe. Participating employees will be able to use it to open doors, log onto their computers, and pay for snacks in the break room. We came across this and saw it being used in other societies. We said, why not us? Why not us? That's the attitude here at Three Square Market in River Falls. The software engineering company has taken the tech world by storm by offering to microchip employees. An opportunity that we saw to really provide something to society. President and CEO Patrick McMullen has been working on this project since January. Employees aren't required to get the chip, it's completely voluntary. It's a big needle though. I think you're still bigger. The company offered me the opportunity to get chips, and I agreed. Not too bad, huh? Not too bad. <laughs> yeah, just a pinch. Yeah. yeah. Breezy. Okay. Convenience. Uh, in a lot of ways, convenience. Um, you know, really eliminating what I have to carry in my, my pockets. Employee Tony Dana says the chip will be used for basic tasks, like getting in and out of the building, logging onto his computer, and buying snacks in the break room. And then to finalize your payment, you'll put your RFID chip, hold it against it, now my unique card that's identified with the RFID chip is asking if I'd like to put the dollar six on my chip. So yes. Since word got out about the chips, Three Square has been contacted by hospitals, universities, even the U.S. and foreign governments about the technology. Imagine being able to travel without a passport or worry about losing it. You just hold your hand up and then all the documentation comes up. The company says this particular chip is not capable of GPS, but they admit that could be in the future. In River Falls, Tim Elliott, WISN 12 News. Reesware says the microchips are made in Taiwan. The company ordered 60 of them. The cost of each chip is believed to be about 